Hello and welcome back to downloadable content. Today's video is all about Bone Lab and Bone Lab mods, and I am super excited this week to show you these awesome ones I found. I, I know I don't want to spoil anything, but let's just say there's a functional portal gun and it is going to be fantastic. Remember, we're doing our challenge to get to 100,000 subscribers by Christmas. It's currently November 1st as of me recording this and probably November 3rd as of you watching this. So we have a little over like a month, two months technically, to smash this goal. I'm really counting on you. Tell your friends, family, enemies, principals, bosses, uh, uh, the slug that you find on the street to subscribe to downloadable content and let's smash this goal. Our first mod on today's list is the Raging Bull Revolver by Shinobi123. It's an awesome revolver, easy to reload and tons of fun. And of course, let's look the part. Let's go to mods and then find the Taurus Raging Bull Revolver. Ooh, spawn. Now, of course, we have to look the part. So let's go and become Arthur Morgan. Yeah, look how hairy my arms are and my broken hands. <laughs> Why are all the Avatar's thumbs like almost backwards? It's so weird. Anyway, let's take this revolver out and uh, let's reload it. So you put it in here. Okay. All right. So <laughs> that's the easy way to put the ammo in. It's from the side here because we don't have, you know, proper SDK yet. And then we... Yeah, okay. And good as new. Wow, look other Fords. Look at this money. We're going to be so rich. Hey, look, it's all the other Fords with the money. I'm going to need that so I can get to Tahiti, all right? Oh, damn it. Give me your money. I'm going to Tahiti. Oh, you're still alive? Well, um, this is awkward because... I need the money and I shot you and your friends are dead. Well, that's okay. I'll just raging bullet you in the forehead. There we go. Now look at all this money we have. We can go be Arthur Morgan or whatever because he lives. Moving right along, we have the giant physical spinning hammer by Caitlin Deb. This is a big boy hammer. You can slaughter Ford with it. No bodies. And well, I, I think the rest is self-explanatory. Let's go into mods and spawn the giant spinning hammer. Now, I'm going to have to stand back because I think this is pretty massive. <laughs> oh, man. Wow, Jesus. Okay. <laughs> I didn't think it would instantly be a giant spinning hammer. Well, that is... <laughs> Can you stop it? Can I stop it? No! Oh! <laughs> I can't stop it. Let's see if we can use a constrainer on it, though. All right, constrainer. We gotta do this in slow motion. All right, here we go. We wanna cut straight to there. Nice. But I needed to kind of get into a different zone now. All right, we're gonna unconstrain it. I need to get it when it's back over there so I can do some mischief. Okay, I'll hold it here. And then once it passes again, right there, yes. Oh boy, oh boy, this is gonna be a blast. We got some Fords. We got some Fords. One Ford, two Ford. <laughs> I don't want them to see anything, so uh, why don't you turn towards me, guys? Hello, hey, what's up? Oh no, the crime I'm about to commit is pretty bad. And now, oh go, Jesus! <laughs> Yeah, I love this thing. This thing is so simple and so cool. And you can use the constrainer to mess around with it. What if I did weak constraints on it? So, okay, so the weak constraint holds it also. Very interesting. And then let go. Yeah, so we're going to have to save this one up. I'm going to wait until it's like... There. Excellent. Let's just constrain it just enough, like there. Spawn a couple of Ford friends. But this time I want them to see it. Now let's unconstrain it in slow-mo so we get the full effect. One, two, three. Get up! Oh, in slow motion, I'm so happy we get to witness this! Boom! Hell yeah! 
Next up is the mod that I am beyond excited to show you. It's Working Portals and Portal Gun by Llamas here. Now this one of course is a work in progress and it's Bone Lab so there's going to be that hidden level of jank but I promise you this is absolutely fantastic and you are just going to just blow your mind with all the things you could do. Special announcement this is only unfortunately for PC so my quest brethren out there unfortunately you cannot use this mod. I know I know I'm very upset. However, if you do have it on PC, you also need Melon Loader, and you have to, one, install Melon Loader, then install this mod the Melon Loader way. It does not go in the normal mod folder. So that's my special uh, announcement. So here it is. In mods, let's scroll through this and find the portal gun. And oh man, get ready to be amazed. So we could put a portal, um, well actually I need a portal gun first. Boop. Come here. Let's put a portal way up there. Nice. And then let's see if we can time this and I'll put one right here. Fall through the floor. <laughs> oh yeah. Look at this. Exactly what you expected to happen. I'm falling forever through my portal. Oh, I missed. Hey, but look how cool this is. I'm going to need a Ford for this. <laughs> look at this. Oh no. Oh, where'd he go? Oh God. Oh, sorry, bud. Uh, oops. I'll try it on this one. Maybe I'll be a little bit more <laughs> cautious. Okay. And bye-bye. Yes. Yes. Did I get the infinite loop? Nope. Physics. What if I spawn him on it? Yes. Oh, my God. Yes. <laughs> yeah, dude. It's actually making... It looked like it was ahead of him. I got to see that again. Okay, buddy. Just like we practice. Boop! <laughs> yeah! Yeah! Eventually, I think it catches up and he goes faster than they can control it. Oh no. I sent him to another plane of existence. Well, that one's on me. Let's put a portal here. And we're going to put a Ford, like, right there. And then I'm going to put the other portal right there. Yeah! Okay, buddy, are you ready to get portal execution? I need to know if I can do this. No, come on. How could you not do that? I can't shoot through the portal? Wait a minute. Maybe I need to go through the portal like this. Oh, hello. I put it through half the level, I'm dumb. All right, I learned my lesson with that one. The portal can't be halfway between things. So that's one portal there good is not it's not I'll touching the ground that's the problem don't have it touch the ground be better with aiming and i'll aim that a little bit higher there we go now i just need a ford and we'll put ford right right about there thanks for volunteering now for the gun let's point it at him and see if it works did you get shot no i'm shooting that one okay so then if i stick the gun through it with my arm but not my whole person I can go into the next dimension and shoot him no it doesn't work no my dreams once again dashed that looks really trippy though fraud it's me <laughs> do my hands pop up over there I wish there was a way to see it right now you know I have I want to try something pick him up don't just don't stand up, okay? Just don't fall through the portal. Back up. Back up, like a two, couple inches this way. Now don't fall over. Yes, 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 yes. Okay, I think I can grab him through the portal. Ready? Hit! <laughs> He's not interactable through the portal. No, my other dream. <laughs> Damn it! It's just working as a portal. I really wish you could do some more physics-based things with the portal. How about this? No roof. This is big. And then we sit down. Okay, buddy. I'm going to attempt to drive this into the portal. And now! <laughs> okay, I have broken Bode Lab. Up next is the Ultimate Atom Smasher by Bafoma the Dude. And I normally don't show avatars unless they are super high tier. And this one is the highest 
the wall tiers so far. It's really setting a new precedent for avatars because as weapons and guns built into the damn avatar, it's fantastic. Download this right now. Let's go into avatars and locate the ultimate atom smasher. There's chatty and quiet. I don't... Let's go with chatty. Yeah, I'm a big boy. All right. We got the big boy stuff. Now, they're supposed to have weapons. So if you grab here... Grab that. Did, did I do it? There we go. That turned on my laser. So now I have weapon mode activated. Form up. How do you, how do you shoot it? Is there a way to shoot it? Oh! There we go. Ah! Boom! Uh, the arm is a little weird though. You can't hold it like this because the elbow bends. But you could hold it kind of like that. And fire! Cool. That turns that off. And now... I think there's another side, right? Oh, man! Machine gun arms, activate! Oh my god! This is such a cool avatar! I'm gonna need some Fords for this. Oh, and the avatar is actually pretty big also. Hello, Ford! I am a large avatar! Don't worry. I got something for you. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh, since you lived through that, here's your present. Boom! Oh my goodness, it's devastating. You, you wish to go next? Excellent. <laughs> this avatar is so dope. And now, I can, uh, I can grab that. Get, I'm trying to grab it with the left hand, fine. I no longer need to grab it with the left hand. Who wants to get machine gun? Wave your hand if you want to get machine gun. Do you want to get machine gun? Bud, bud, no? Making me look dumb? That's what you get for making me look dumb. I want to be able to fire like rockets. Freeze. <laughs> I got to see one in ultra slow motion, dude. I'm sorry. This is the slowest of all motions. I got to... Um, hold on. My arm's being weird. Well, aim it first. Oh, no. It makes the arm go that way. Slowest of all motions. Dang it. It makes the physics all weird. But it's okay. I have another way of disbanding with you. Yeah! Man, this avatar is so dope. How did I not know this one yet? Present machine gun and shotgun. <laughs> I love this thing. It's so cool. Moving on, we have the Water Park 2.0 by Spencer Johnson. This one is amazing. Just go in there and have a blast with your different vehicles and bone tubes and what have you. It has been updated to add more rides and more slides. So you can actually bring your friends in multiplayer and have a fun day at the Water Park. Here we are at the Water Park Sandbox 2.0. There's a shark. Oh, look at all these stuff. Like you could spend hours here and have yourself a grand old time. <laughs> uh, it's just so many things to do. I'm getting excited. Well, the first thing I'm going to want to do is go into this little go kart here. And we're going to go kart, you know. We're going to go right down here. All right, go kart. Let's do this. <laughs> yeah. Wow, this is really trippy. I am uh, all the colors. This is going to be big. I can sense this drop. Woo-wee! And then we go into the toilet. Up the side of it. Now, like I said, you could do this stuff in multiplayer also. Am I not going to make that? Oh, no. I'm going to make it. Yeah! They made the slides better from 1.0. 1.0, you got stuck pretty often. But this one, not at all. I'm having a blast with this one. But I already know what else I must do on another slide. Yeah, we <laughs> Now, of course, I'm going to have to spawn a bone tube. You know, it'd be a missed opportunity if I didn't. Let's put this here. You know what? Actually, I'm going to need a constrainer for this one. Otherwise, bad things are going to happen. Now, what we're going to do is we're going to constrain this all the way back to there. Now, we hop in. Switch it to unconstrained mode. Unconstrained mode! Let's do this! You guys ready for the ultimate VR throw up experience? Close one eye if you want to, th don't throw up. <laughs> wow, <laughs> this is a blast, holy goodness. <laughs> Whoa, yeah. That was a ton of fun, but now I want to share the fun with my friends. Okay, buddy Ford, 
You ready to go in my stead into the water park? Uh, no. Shut up. Don't be all goofy right now. No, 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 no. Get in there. <laughs> no, wait. Don't go down the slide. I don't want to put you down that slide. That slide's not fun. This one over here, this one is fun. So what we'll do to not have any accidents. Oh, no, an accident. I need a new bone tube. Okay, your turn. I'm gonna become Big Thick Boy so I can easily pick you up. Come on, Big Thick Boy time. <laughs> Look at him, struggling. It's okay though, I know you wanna have fun. Oh, what the hell? <laughs> Don't do that. No, no, no. Keep your hands and feet in the vehicle at all times. Listen, you're rooting the water park. There's a bunch of people lining up. Your turn is now. Well, <laughs> I'm going down it with him. Oh no. Ford, are you okay? Oh my god, it despawned him. That gives me an idea for this giant hammer thing again. Oh yeah, oh it's going the wrong direction. Oops. I just gotta be careful. I can't get smacked by this thing. There we go. Now I must constrain it. All right, so when it hits its apex about there. Excellent. All right, kids, step on up to the water park new ride. You're gonna have a blast. I guarantee it. Let's go ahead and switch on. Are you ready? Didn't think so. And have fun. Boom! Oh, Jesus Christ! It didn't hit the slide at all. No, uh, no, no! I'm falling down the slide again. Ow! I work here. Well, as you can see, you can have unlimited fun at this water park. So I don't want to keep you here any longer than you have to. Make sure you download this mod, single player, multiplayer. I promise you that you will not be disappointed. You're gonna have a, a load of fun. I'm killing time until I can make this jump. But make sure you download this mod! I'm not gonna make that. Up next, we have the Patented Force Amplication Device by Babacorp. Babacorp has made amazing mods in the past from Boneworks all the way to Bone Lab, and this one is no exceptions. Have so much fun blasting off with this one. You can use it on vehicles, yourself, enemies, and well, have a blast. We're gonna go into Baba Corp and select the application force modifier. Let's spawn one of them. Look at this thing. It's cool. And now I believe if you squeeze it here. Wow! Oh, turn it off! Turn it off! Oh, Jesus! That means can I just fly with it? Oh no, oh no, I'm not holding it in both hands. Hold it in both hands. Now do it. Yeah! I got myself a jetpack! Hell yeah! I'm going too high, aren't I? Go down? Oh no, oh no. Hit. Oh my gosh, there's so many things that my brain just thought of. Come on, brain, let's go over here and think. Yes, yes, Mr. Ford. I have a great design for you. You're going to be the world's first jetpack boy. How does that sound? I want my boy to be safe up there. Don't turn around, ah, oh, you goofus. You've ruined everything. You turned around and now you won't turn around again because you're obnoxious. He's trying to turn around. He's like, I really want him to turn around, though. Uh, that looks fine. One on the butt. Don't want to be. Okay. So let's turn that one on. It turn. Hey, God, bud. Turn that on. It, I can't reach that one. Stop wiggling around. Okay, it's all on. He's swinging, don't do this. And let's go to slow mode so we can really experience this. Enjoy! Oh, God. oh nothing's happening. Oh, no. He's suffering. Ford, buddy, are you suffering? Oh, no. Oh, God. Oh, God. Um, I put him out of misery. Boop, boop, boop. I'm sorry, man. I have to send you to the upside down. All right, I know what I did wrong there. That won't happen again. I'll take proper precaution this time. So I want one probably on, on his butt. It's probably like one of the best spots for one. Now we gotta let him live out his dream of becoming Iron Man. Don't worry, you will be the world's greatest Iron Man, but on a budget. Don't worry, I'm a scientist. I know what I'm doing. And by scientist, I mean I'm demented. <laughs> You're gonna boldly go where no man's gone before, I hope. If not, then uh, we have insurance. That repulsor is turned on. That one is operating normally. Okay, I'm going to remove the target weld. And lift off. 
Oh no, Ford! Oh man, I should have called his grandma to tell him what was going on! This is fine. This is... Everything's normal. Ford? Yeah! To the moon, baby! Our penultimate entry on today's Bone Lab Mod Showcase is Agent 47 by Bone Lab Modder. Now you're wondering, Drifter, why are you showing a random avatar when you just said you don't showcase avatars that much? Well, that's because this one looks awesome. It also has tie physics, and anytime I can cosplay as Agent 47, like almost IRL, I'm all for it. Let's go into avatars and look for our Agent 47. Oh, with physics, here we go. Look at me, my thumb is the right direction and everything. And look, I have tie physics. So when I move around, blah, 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 so this is the tie. <laughs> yeah! Now, which one of these fours is my target? I can't afford not to get it. <laughs> look at this tie. <laughs> blah, 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 blah. This tie is so cool. Agent 47, get it? <laughs> Isn't that a funny, okay. Open your mouth. Are you the target? No, you're probably not the target. Which one are you the target? Because I, I don't know. I, I, I don't have a bit set up. I should have set up a bit for this one. I'm just going to go ahead and shoot Ford. Yeah. Um, Agent 47 got his right target. I just wanted to show you guys how cool this avatar is. You know, it's not cursed. The hands work. The tie looks awesome. And, of course, I'm Agent 47. Our final entry on today's list is the Gravity Menu by Sewer. Now, this one requires melon loaders, so unfortunately, oh, my Quest users out there, you can't get this mod. And if you're on PC, you must install melon loader and install it a different way to use this mod. That being said, here's Gravity. So this gravity menu can be a bit of a pain when you're using it with other mods just because it's bound to the left stick. What you do is you click the left stick in and now it's up. So then I move the right stick up or down. But when I have it selected on Earth, if I just use the trigger on the other controller, I can switch it. So now I'm at moon gravity. So when I jump, I'm set to moon gravity. So let's close that for a second. You and I, moon gravity. Look, they get affected also, which is great. So can I, I finally grab him and then jump really high with him? God, jump high, Dragon Ball Z, smash to the ground. <laughs> Imagine, do, 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 do. that'd be sick. That would be sick. But let's try out some other stuff. Let's do Mars gravity. This one, I think, is Mars more gravity? Oh, no. Okay, it's it's kind of like moon. How about Jupiter? Jupiter, I feel like, you know, we're going to get, like, crushed. Like, he's going to fall like he's made out of, like, pure iron. I can't even lift him. That's how, how much gravity it is now. It affects everything. Arrgh, look at this. I can't pick him up over my head. <laughs> Pluto gravity. We're on Pluto, man. Um, can you... Hello? I didn't expect to jump this high. I didn't realize how much not gravity there is on Pluto. So let's switch that to fake zero gravity. This one is a load of fun because you have to bounce off things. Like, I probably should not have jumped, but I did. Because I, I did an oopsie, I'm not going to lie. Reload this gun. Zero G spin. <laughs> Fighting in zero G is absolutely awesome because you're bouncing off things and then the dead float. Ammo floats. Ah! <laughs> Look how cool this is. It's so fun to do. Isn't that right? Boop. Ah. Yeah. This is a blast. And of course, you can reset it now. So I go down to here. I select Earth. And we come crashing back down to the ground. Fantastic. He might be mad at me. But that's okay. I have a gun. They don't. But yeah, this is... The Gravity Adjuster. Well, my friends, that is it for this week's mod showcase for Bone Lab. I hope you had a ton of fun. And more importantly, I hope you download these mods because they are freaking sweet. All linked in the mod description down below. And remember, I'm doing the challenge to get to 100,000 subscribers by Christmas. Hashtag 100K by Christmas. Make sure you are subscribed, your friends, your family, your loved ones, your not so loved ones, your boss, your principal, the slug. Remember the slug? Make sure they are all subscribed. And I will greatly appreciate it. Let's smash this goal by Christmas. But other than that, I want to thank you so much for stopping by. I'm Rob from Downloadable Content, and I'll see you in the next video. Uh, Nuss.